Hi. Today I want to show you how you can pre-compile your code. I mean, you can deploy your code as in pre-compiled form instead to to deploy the source code. You could do that for security reason or simply to have to avoid compilation on the on the, on the production server. Um, take the simple example. We make a string output and the date and when I put that in the browser you get that no magic there and every time you execute the class uh, sorry a cfml file in in lucy lucy compiles that file to a java class then execute that in you can file that comp pilot class file in the web in folder you have in your web root there in there there you see the folder lucy inside that folder you find the folder cf classes in that folder there is for every mapping you have there is a folder in that case we are in pre video precompiled files we see that here is that folder for the mapping i go in there you have video precompiled files so there is the class file created for that index.cfm. When I simply grab that class, copy it over next to the source file, and rename it to test.cfm. In that case, okay. Then. I go back to the browser, change the URL to this file, that test.cfm. I execute it and it still works. You see, exactly the same as before. I can execute that. And when you go to the, the file itself, you see it's no longer a source chart, CFML source file, it's now a binary file. And it starts with coffee babe, that means that is a Java bytecode file. You can decompile these files with a Java decompiler, but if it works, you only get Java source code. So it don't you don't get back the CFML code and a Java source code really makes not a lot of sense. And in most cases you can't even decompile the Java source code because the bytecode uh, Lucy writes is not really compatible to Java source code so in most cases you can't decompile it at all so it's from security perspective it's not a hundred percent secure but it's much more secure than simply deploy the source file and it's for sure um, faster because you don't have to compile the code anymore I hope this video was helpful to you. Have a good one.